Alrighty guys, Bearded Red here. Welcome back to the channel. Uh, as you can see, I'm in the woods. Um, I haven't done any shooting or anything today. I'm actually doing something a little bit different. So I've started to do some bushcraft slash survival slash camping kind of stuff. I've been really interested in it. Uh, I've been watching the show alone, which I know has been out for a little while, but if you guys haven't seen it, go check it out. It's pretty cool. So the premise of the show is they take 10 people, throw them in the woods. They have 10 survival items they can pick and last man standing wins. Uh, so it's pretty cool. I've always loved that bushcraft kind of stuff and watching guys build stuff out of nothing in the woods and living and stuff like that. So like some real pioneer kind of stuff. Uh, so I figured I would try that. Now, obviously I'm not going to be living out here in the woods, nothing like that, but I wanted to build a bushcraft camp and test camping gear, survival gear, um, different pieces of kit, tools, stuff like that to see one, can I do it as somebody who has average skills with camping and bushcrafting and pretty much the generic stuff every Boy Scout would have kind of a thing. Um, and really put that to the test and see what I'm capable of, see what I can do, and hopefully bring you guys along for the adventure if it's something you guys are interested in. I think it's pretty neat. Um, but where we are right now is middle of the woods. Let's see if I can make you guys dizzy by spinning around. Uh, I try to go to a part of the property that is very secluded I love the pines, so I wanted to be out in the pines. Uh, so where I'm standing is base camp one. I've cleared the ground out. That hole right there is from a stump right there. That's gonna be my fire pit. Um, right there is gonna be my bed. It's gonna be a wall right here, front door, and then a wall, a good solid start. There's not a lot of deadfall. There is that guy right behind me that I'm gonna trim out. And a couple of smaller things when I bring my ax out here, I'm gonna chop down, but yeah, so this is the start of the camp. I'm pretty excited about it. Uh, the plan is to build walls, build a roof, fire pit, uh, full shebang. This is hopefully I'm going to build a bed frame. Uh, I, I don't know. You know, like, I don't know. I'm, I'm new to this, but I want to try it. I want to build a legit bushcraft camp and bring you guys along. Like I said, I have average skills when it comes to this. I haven't been through any survival training. Uh, so here we are. We're going to try this. If you guys want to come along, I would love to. Bring you guys along and show you guys i'll be updating uh where i'm at both on instagram and here on youtube so this is gonna be a new like mini series it might be a bigger series uh depending on how you guys receive this how you like it uh, but this is day one got the ground cleared next is going to be clearing all this deadfall out and then building the walls will probably be the next and then fire pit uh, again i don't know so the whole point of this is to bring you guys along from an average dude's perspective of learning survival skills, bushcraft skills, camping skills, testing out different gears, all the stuff that goes along with bushcrafting. I plan on testing, giving you guys my thoughts uh, while also using it, uh, how it's supposed to be used. Uh, this channel's gonna be, this series is gonna be more laid back, sorry, the sun's in your face, more laid back, uh, not a lot of super fancy cuts, probably not a lot of red shots, like obviously right now I forgot my tripod. Uh, so some of the shots you'll see me clearing the ground is hanging on a tree branch right there. Um, so super low budget productions. Um, but yeah, I, I hope you guys like this kind of stuff. If you do, great. Let me know in the comments below um, of what gear I should test, what gear I should use, uh, recommendations on how to build walls, how to build stuff. You know, this is more to help me and you guys learn these skills. You know, let's help each other out with that because I need to know it. I think it'd be something cool to know. Uh, but yeah, so guys, I, I really appreciate it. If you guys want to support the channel, Obviously, liking, subscribing, sharing, watching the videos. Uh, but check down the description below. In all my videos, I try to do Amazon affiliate links. It gives me a little bit of commission. If you guys buy something, I'll post down there gear of what I use, stuff in the videos that you guys might see in the background or something. Uh, and just general kit that I've used, personally used, and like, I'll put down in there. So if you guys want to buy that, click on it, buy it, and that will help me out. Or if you want to click on the link and then go buy toilet paper, it also helps me out. But any kind of money that I make from either Google, like YouTube, or Amazon will go straight back in the channel to buy gear to bring to you guys and to test. Uh, the first set of gear I bought um, with my YouTube money, <laughs> the whole $100 that I've made over the past two years of filming this, um, I got a survival kit uh, from Amazon. So I'm going to test those items out. We're going to see, can an average dude actually use a $44 Amazon survival kit and it actually do anything? Is all the gear in that crap? Is any of it worth anything? So we're gonna test that out and see. That video, I will probably film the first part of it today or tomorrow, which 
today is the 19th. This video will get uploaded immediately. Probably no editing. Uh, so take that for what it's worth. This is what we're going to be what you're going to be experiencing. Uh, so guys, thanks so much for liking the video, subscribing, sticking around. Uh, hopefully you like this kind of stuff. If you do, leave a thumbs up and let me know that you like it. If not, leave a thumbs down. Uh, stay tuned to Instagram as well, The Bearded Wretch. I'll be posting updates and stuff like that on this, as well as life on the farm, ridiculous videos, gun stuff, all kinds of fun stuff. So guys, thanks so much. Stay strapped, and I'll see you at the range.